So if you're wondering how someone brand new to keyboard and mouse can go from looking like this to looking like this. Oh. They just take the wall, bro. They just take the wall too. Where y'all live at, man? Don't matter. Oh my god! <laughs> well, let me show y'all. What's good with y'all boys, man? First of all, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for 8,000 subscribers. It's insane bro six months ago i released my week progression video and it blew up God, ah! i think it's about to hit like 700k or something like that which kickstarted my channel and i just wanted to say thank you guys so much for all the support on every single progression video i've uploaded so far so just like the last one i want to give back to you guys I'm going to be giving away $20 cash app or Venmo to three people, or you can choose if you want a skin from the item shop. All you have to do to enter is subscribe to the YouTube channel and leave a like on this video and go to the comment section, type in gang forward slash your epic username. But I'm going to be picking the three winners on February 15th of 2024 on live stream. So like I said, again, make sure you're subscribed and turn on that notification bell so you know when I go live. But anyways, again, y'all, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for the support. <laughs> Y'all boys thought I forgot. Bella. And let's get right into my six month transformation video. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys my best warm up routine and the best practice maps that I use on a daily basis. My new and improved updated keybinds, how I found my perfect sensitivity. And at the end, I'm going to show you all a bunch of my best clips that I hit in these six months and tell you guys what I'm thinking when I'm in a fight. And I put the timestamps down in the description, so feel free to skip around the video if you really want to watch a certain part. So, let's get started. So, the very first thing that I do when I load up Fortnite is load up the Raiders Mechanics Training Version 4 map. And I usually go to the free build section first, and I put it on the slow-mo, and I like to just do triple edits until I get my triple edits consistent, because that's what I have the most trouble with usually. So, after I've done the slow-mo a couple times, I'll put it back to normal speed and try to put everything together. Once everything's looking good, I'll go to the edit section. And now this one is extremely good because it puts you in uncomfortable situations and you have to make the edit. Now both of these next maps are made by the boy Ken Beans. And the first one we got is the W Keyer 1v1. Now I'm telling y'all, if y'all wanna get good at fighting, you have to play this map. It puts you in a bunch of different scenarios and one player is fully healthy and the other player is weak and they have to box up and heal up before the W Keyer comes and pushes them. This map forces you to get good at fighting, taking walls, phasing in. And if you're the weak player, it teaches you how to rebox and get out of bad situations. Next up by the boy Kim Beans, we have a realistic peace control, edit, and aim. This map has a bunch of scenarios where you have to tunnel in, pre-box the bot, and then hit a nasty shot. I swear to God, I didn't even mean to rhyme right there. I swear to God. This map also features a free build section, a pre-firing section, which is really good, and then a fast peace control section. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I don't do this map every day, but I probably should.
Now, as far as my keybinds go, I'm not going to go too much into detail because I have a separate video of my best settings and they haven't changed. So if you want to see that video, I'll put it in the top right of the screen right now. But they're the same old keybinds that I still use. So I'm going to be scrolling through this pretty fast, but feel free to pause the video whenever you want. Now, as far as my sensitivity, this changes, I swear to God, like every week. And it's probably the same case with you guys. Some days I'm feeling like it's too fast and I need to work on my aim better so I lower it. And then some days I think it's too slow where my mechanics are slacking so I raise it again. But as of this moment today, it is 6.3 X and Y sensitivity. I found that this sensitivity is extremely good for both mechanics and aim because I feel like I slack more with my aim than I do with my mechanics. So I think 6.3 is a sweet spot. And really the only way to find your perfect sensitivity is to play the game a f ton. <laughs> okay, nah, but for real, like you have to play the game a lot. There is no secret, there's no sweet spot for each individual person. Like you, you have to find it on your own. There's no way anybody else can help you. And even picking my sensitivity or Clix's sensitivity or Peterbot's sensitivity, like it's not gonna change. Like you have to find what works for you. Even with the targeting and scope sensitivity, both of those are huge components of gameplay. So if you're not feeling something that's right, change it. I hope that made sense. So if you got anything from what I just said, just dedicate your life to Fortnite and you'll be all right. So moving on to the clips section of this video, these are my best clips that I've hit in these six months, I think. I've also deleted a lot, but these are the ones that I currently have on my PC right now. And we'll just start with the intro clip. So this scenario, I'm reviving my shitty ass teammate. He's always dead, like always. I'm just kidding, I love you, Stanley. Anyways, they're shooting my bills and I'm automatically gonna try and hold the wall. But as you guys will see, they both take my wall first try. I don't know where these guys live at, but I need to move there. So after I noticed that they both took my wall first try, I knew I had to push one of them. And seeing that the other guy already took the other wall and I couldn't do anything about it, I had to push the guy on my right. So with these guys having the best ping, I knew my aim had to be incredible. So I just stayed calm and made sure I hit a headshot. And that's exactly what I did. After I killed that guy, I reboxed up. I probably should have put a cone on top of my head, but oh well. The guy was just gonna run around the box like a brain dead f So I edited the way that he was running and I hit the headshot. Oh my God. <laughs> so with this next clip i was at least fighting this dude for like three minutes at least but i decided it's time to go because the storm's about to push in it's in-game situation so i did but i get absolutely fried bro not the smartest move but i box up and i see this brain dead idiot just trying to spray into my box so this is where those free fire drills come in baby hit him with that bah. and i think the shot gave my boy kevin an orgasm oh my god i'm the greatest now this one was hit on my boy Ryan, man. I'm sorry, Ryan. I gotta put you in here. If y'all don't know Ryan, y'all should definitely go check him out. His link will be down in the description. Shout out to my boy Ryan. He streams every day, but I got both of our POVs because we were both streaming. <laughs> y'all can just watch for y'all sales, man. Bro, I feel like crack, my man. Oh, no. no! No, he's not ready for us. Oh, no. Bro, Smitty, you're feeling cracked like this right now? Nah, Smitty! Oh, no. No, Smitty, no! Oh, my! He was crazy right there. What? Yo, don't ever do that to me again on my stream, Smitty. Oh, my. Okay, now this clip was hit on my boy Jared. <laughs> this one was bad. He just looked lost this whole time. So I see homie trying to build up. And the first thing that I do is I jump to the side and automatically put a cone on top of his head to block him off. And I put my wall so I claim the wall that he's on. So I flip my stair, edit the wall, and I hit the first shot. Now I know exactly where he's going because he's just readable. So I do the same thing. I build up, I cone him again. <laughs> and then I just take him out, bro. Back to the lobby. 
Now th this clip was disgusting. I still think this is probably my best one to this day and it was hit such a long time ago. I've been wanting to show y'all guys this for so long. I see this guy build up. I'm hitting a nice double edit. I put a wall and edit it for no apparent reason. I jump on my floor, hit the wall, hit him with the cone and I just take him out, bro. I was so proud of this clip for so long. And some of you guys did see it on stream, but not a lot of you guys did. So I'm happy I can show you guys all now. This clip was hit on my boy Kevin. You remember the one that had the orgasm earlier? God, I'm the greatest. But this isn't anything special. This is me just playing slow and strategic. So I take his wall and now I'm pushing in trying to take his stair. And I hit the stair once because I know he thinks I'm going to hit it again and take a pre-fire. So I hit it once, back up, reset my wall, and make a window edit. I missed the shot, but that's all right. I take his stair successfully, and then I'm editing the way that he is going and taking a shot. And there it is, Kevin. Back to the lobby, bro. So guys, this is just another example of putting a cone on top of their head and claiming their wall. It's gonna catch so many players off guard and they're not gonna know what to do. You're gonna win a shit ton of more fights. Just look at this guy, he is lost. He don't know what to do. This clip was also hit during the OG season, so it was a super long time ago. But again, I put the cone on top of his head and I pumped him. My God. So I start feeling myself, I start doing some triple edits, and then I end up doing this. This is also an extremely old clip, but this is just to reiterate the importance of hitting pre-fires. I am 22 health with a down teammate in my box. That's the only reason he got the wall in the first place. But he made a dumb edit and I pumped him again. Back to the lobby. This clip was hit when chapter five had just come out and this was still off spawn. I already had four kills. I was kind of going crazy this game, but I hear homie jump down. So I know he's about to push. So I box up and then here pre-fire drills baby i'm telling y'all bow travis got down i hear his homie trying to come behind me i replace my wall edit it bow back to oh the lobby god. bro <laughs> oh my god <laughs> yo oh my god for this one bro i'm not even gonna say it again you already know what i'm about to say Now, I don't know what these kids were doing, but I just shit on them. There's nothing really else to say about this clip, bro. Now, with this clip, I was really trying to make this kid a victim. I was really going for a clip on this kid, but I'm gonna let the gameplay do the talking. This was nasty. I had a triple it on his dumb ass, 103. Think, dead? What the fuck is he talking about? Like, what? I see that clip, bro. It was crazy. I'm just saying. I'm so good, bro. The rest of these clips are just gonna be me showing off my aim to you guys. They're pretty standard, nothing really special about them, but they're also clips that I'm proud of. What the fuck do they got going on back here, nigga? Stupid. <laughs> nah, bro. Damn, everybody else talks at me. Oh my god. Like, I'm just... I got something for that. I got something for that. <laughs>
Oh my fucking god, you yeah, suck. You one punt me, bro. I had a hundred. This guy and he's fucking like cracked. Oh, he's oh on my drugs. god! Oh like, wow! Thomas, yeah, no, no. no I'm Spitty. Who are you, Spitty? Who the fuck are you? Oh, oh my god! Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> Clip that! Clip that! <laughs> Thomas just got bullied. Fuck out of here, you fucking shit, you bitch. Get your shit on. Bad. Mm -hmm. Look at him. Probably dumb. Hot. Hot. Yeah, nigga, still hit your motherfucking ass, nigga. <laughs> That's a bot, nigga. <laughs> So good at this shit, bro. Fucking suck, bro. Shut the fuck up. I know, dude. Sorry, Kevin. Sorry, man. You're the greatest <laughs> nigga ever. Is that what you want to fuck you in? Quick. Talk to me, nigga. God damn. Oh, what you getting mad now, nigga? Nigga, I'm not mad. You just on my dick for what? Nigga, I don't give a fuck. Man, how you hit me, bro? <laughs> That's damn, crazy. I'm on the ground. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm on the ground. Oh, shit. 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 Oh, that nigga in that box. Hey. That looks right here. I mean, be for real. Scream, come get me. All right, fellas, that is going to do it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. This took so so long to edit so it would mean the absolute world if you guys leave a like on this video share it with your friends and make sure you're subscribed also don't forget about the giveaway turn on those notifications so you know when i go live if you want to check out this day in a life video that i made just click in the middle of your screen and i'll see you guys on the next one it's been smitty and i'm out y'all peace